This tutorial video describes how to use Virtual Appliance Manager as the initial setup and configuration tool for Hitachi Op Center Administrator. The Virtual Appliance Manager tool is used to configure network settings, add network time protocol servers, download logs to review task statuses, and find system files and restore configuration settings using the Backup and Restore feature. After you've deployed Administrator, you can access Virtual Appliance Manager at HTTP IP address forward slash VAM, where IP address is your IP address for Administrator. The default login username is Service, and the default password is ChangeMe. Note that the service account used to access Virtual Appliance Manager is not the same role as the sysadmin account used to access Administrator. Change the default password after logging into Virtual Appliance Manager for the first time. This password is only for Virtual Appliance Manager and changing it does not affect the login for Administrator. The Virtual Appliance Manager password should only be used by system administrators. Virtual Appliance Manager settings are critical to product operations. Configure network settings right after you deploy Storage Advisor. Enter the IP range in the Docker subnet field. Optionally, you can enter a host name. Click DHCP on. This will populate the IP address subnet mask, default gateway, primary DNS, and additional DNS. The SNMP IP cannot be changed in Virtual Appliance Manager. Note that once you turn DHCP on, you cannot edit the IP address, subnet mask, default gateway, primary DNS, additional DNS, or the SNMP IP address. Click Submit, then wait for the VM to reboot. To continue configuring settings in Virtual Appliance Manager, you'll need to wait a few minutes and then log back into Virtual Appliance Manager. Note that you can find details for installing Administrator in a static environment in the Hitachi Administrator Getting Started Guide. To add an NTP server, click the Time tab and click the plus sign to add an NTP server hostname or IP address and then click Submit. In the Logs screen, you can control the application log file size by entering the value in megabits. When the file reaches maximum, the system writes a new file. You can also configure the number of files the system will retain, with old files exceeding this number being deleted. Finally, you can select the appropriate log level from the drop-down menu. Info is the default setting and provides regular log messages with no additional information. Debug includes debug messages in addition to regular log messages. Trace includes trace information in addition to regular log messages. In audit log settings, you can enable or disable audit logging, configure how long to retain audit logs, or delete them immediately. Once you are finished with your changes, click Submit. In the Advanced window, under Service Settings, you can configure values for the SI token. A default SSL certificate is provided, but if you need to replace it, generate a signed certificate and import it into the Certificate Settings in the Advanced tab. You can delete a domain and configure a new domain in the Domain tab. Enter a new domain name TCP port and IP address and click Submit. Highlight a registered domain and click Delete to delete the domain. In Virtual Appliance Manager, you can download the audit logs, use backup to save settings from your Virtual Appliance Manager setup, save administrator configurations, and preserve inventories. Backup can be used for updating to a new version of Administrator. Click Backup to download a tar.gz file. Note the creation of the tar file may take a few minutes. Be sure to keep the tar file in a safe location, and when you're ready to restore, for example, after an upgrade, log in to Virtual Appliance Manager, click Restore, and click the plus sign to select the backup file. 
click Submit to finish, and wait for the VM to reboot. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to find additional information regarding Virtual Appliance Manager or Hitachi Storage products, please visit knowledge.hitachivantara.com.